Congratulations for Yasmin Fahimi, the newly elected General Secretary of the Social Democratic Party. Though she's a comparative unknown, it's now her job to be the public face of the SPD and provide support for the head of the party. Fahimi had a strong showing, winning the post with about 88% of the vote on Sunday. I had hoped for this show of support, and I'm pleased to be starting the job with such a definite mandate, which is encouraging. But I'm also aware that it sets a target for me to meet. When you're elected as a newcomer to the office, you have to do justice to that vote of confidence. As General Secretary, Yasmin Fahimi will have to help sharpen the party's platform and image. As the junior partner in the Grand Coalition, the SPD runs the risk of being plowed under by the Christian Democrats. It's a daunting task, and Fahimi is a former trade union official who has little experience in national politics. She's top-notch. I didn't know her at all before, but she's got the brains and the heart for the job. She won the backing of the party, and the vote shows that. Everyone has to start somewhere, and she's no greenhorn. She has a trade union background, and that's also a national issue. So she has plenty of organizational experience. This is where Yasmin Fahimi gained her experience, at the trade union offices of the mining, chemical and energy industry, where she was head of political planning. Now her office is full of moving boxes. Not everyone here will be sad to see her leave. Though no one is willing to speak on camera, some say that Fahimi has a reputation for arrogance. There's even gossip that she owes her career to her partner, who heads the union. One of the people who knows her well is department head Ralph Becker. He was Fahimi's boss several years ago. When conflicts start to simmer, she finds a way out of them and a way to solve them. That's one of her strengths. And she can be quite adamant when people get stuck in hardline positions. Then she tends to be very incisive, direct and goal-oriented in her arguments. Those qualities are likely also what attracted the attention of SPD head Zygmar Gabriel. He backed her candidacy. But Yasmin Fahimi also brings with her strong contacts to business and industry. Within the union, she's known as a longtime supporter of the energy industry. Some of her critics have even accused her of inappropriate lobbying. It's actually a good thing that I have contacts and know people on boards of corporations. I have experience talking to industry representatives. And of course the party will benefit from those contacts. As federal minister for economic affairs and energy, SPD head Zygmar Gabriel is also strengthening his own position by bringing Fahimi on board. Her election also helps bring a modern and cosmopolitan face to the party. Fahimi's father was born in Iran, but she herself does not find that particularly noteworthy. Maybe it has shaped me as a person and given me a more open view of things and made me curious about things that are different from me. I don't shy away from things that are new or different. Yasmin Fahimi's move into the ranks of the SPD leadership is a mark of her fortitude. Now it's up to her to prove that she can live up to the vote of confidence.